How's it going everyone? It's Josh here with American Wilderness. Today I'm going over the Little River Co. camping hammock and hanging straps. Matt over at Little River Co. was nice enough to send this hammock over to us so we can test it out. So we're going to go ahead and get it set up and we'll go over some more specs on it. Alright everyone, so this is Little River Co's ultra durable double hammock. Uh, this is navy blue and light blue, they do come in uh, different colors, you know, green and brown I believe, so if you're not into the blue you can still get what you want. But this is I believe 114 by 78 inches, it can hold 400 pounds, each of the straps is rated for 200. And I'm going to sit in it here so you can see how it kind of works. You can sit in it like this if you want, as a camp chair, or you can lay down and lay a little bit sideways. And as you can see, you can kind of get pretty enveloped in this thing. So if there are any bugs out, you can always keep them off you with that. All right, everyone, so the hammock is made out of a durable parachute nylon. It's really tough, you don't have to worry about that breaking on you. And these straps are actually made out of a polyfilament. And uh, this hanging system is actually pretty unique. I've never seen this done before. It's where you take this ring, and then you hold it on the tree, and then you wrap the strap around and then when it gets to the right length you feed it through the ring then hook the carabiner on the hammock onto the ring and as you can see on this tree it's a little bit smaller so you have to wrap around a few more times and on that tree over there you only had to wrap around once so it takes about maybe five minutes to set up um, this hammock runs for about 46 47 dollars on amazon with the hanging straps i'm not sure what the prices are for different colors so you'd have to go check that out for yourself there'll be a link in the description if you're interested so um, yeah, I definitely will recommend this hammock. I really like how uh, these two lighter blue covers on the hammock here kind of cover up and you can kind of lock that in if there's bugs or if it's a little wet out, you can cover up with that a little bit. Alright guys, so packing this hammock up, it's nice and simple, nice and easy. All you have to do is unhook one side, sort of bunch it up, and then unhook the other. All you have to do is bunch it in this sort of incorporated little sack here, little stuff sack. Let's open that up. This all fits in here. Nice and snug. And this whole system, along with the straps, which also have their own little separate stuff sack, weighs about 2.3 pounds, I believe. Uh, maybe a little more, maybe a little less, I'm not sure. But definitely not a burden to carry around in your bag. You can even stuff this in a cargo pocket if you wanted to. Let's pull the drawstring. Tighten that up, and if you want to, I believe this is what this strap on the outside is for, is actually to compress this down a little bit. There you go. Nice little ball. Right, so the way that these came, were actually wrapped up together like this, I believe. So I'm going to wrap it back up, and then it should fit nicely inside this stuff sack that it comes with. Only takes a couple minutes to pack this whole thing up. Then this is a little sack that it comes in with a drawstring on it, so I just slide this in here. And tighten that up, lock it in, and there you go. Little Riverco company logo on there, along with the hammock stuff sack as well. And this, along with the hammock bag, it's fit like that, maybe this big of an area, it's easy for a whole uh, sleeping system, you know, besides a sleeping bag. That's all you need, and that's uh, a lot smaller than a tent, a lot smaller than carrying a big tarp to set up some sort of shelter. Alright, so I want to thank you guys for watching this video. I'm Josh with American Wilderness. If you're interested in this hammock, there'll be a link in the description. I definitely recommend it, and I'll see you guys in the next video.